the hills are alive with the sound of music. Well, maybe not the hills, but Fernie certainly is. For a small mountain town of about 6,000 people, Fernie has an astounding concentration of musical talent. From local performances to the global stage, our community fosters musicians who represent a variety of styles and unique sound. Let's meet some of them, shall we? This one's dedicated to anybody that's ever worked out. Shred Kelly is Fernie's most infamous band. They have performed across Canada, in the US, and even on some pretty big stages in Europe. Still, they say there's no better energy than from the home crowd here in Fernie. Oh, how are you, Sadie? I'm great. I'm so excited to be sitting here with you. Thank you for having us. We're so excited to be here. So tell me, how many years have Shred Kelly been together? Since 2009. So that's <laughs> 14 years. You first began the band. What, what was the goal? Was the goal just to go out and have fun and play gigs or did you ever imagine that you would get to this point where you're touring in Europe, into the U.S.? Uh, no, I don't think so. I think initially it was just to see what we could do. And we, we just, our first year after we were, we were a band for a little while, we decided that we would try to tour across Canada. As long as new opportunities continue to present themselves or like the trajectory seems to be fun for us, then we'll keep doing it. And so it hasn't really stopped. So we just keep going. I think places like Fernie provide a space where people are encouraged to live alternate lifestyles. And I think sort of the focus here isn't always on, um, you know, who is the highest earner or what kind of merit your job has. And so people are able to kind of do their passions instead. Mm -hmm. And I think that just being allowed to do that allows creatives to get out there and pursue it. Who are some of these new bands in Fernie that you're listening to? Oh, there's so many. Fernie <laughs> has such a good music scene. There's, uh, there's Mount Reshka, who's doing lots of shows and touring and putting out new songs all the time. And Electric Blanket. Lush Please, Nell Smith, who uh, is doing very big things. The Runs, our team opened for them earlier this year. I'd say the most iconic band in Fernie. They've been around the longest. One, two, three, four! My name is Nell Smith, I'm 15 years old, and I'm a professional singer-songwriter based out of Fernie, BC. She may be young, but Nell Smith is no ordinary teenager. Why? Oh, you know, she just happened to tour the world with a three-time Grammy winner from the US, The Flaming Lips, when she was just 14. When I was like about 10 years old, I did want to be a singer. I did singing camps with Rachel um, and like sang with a group and really enjoyed it and decided that I wanted to be a singer. I definitely didn't imagine that it would happen like how it did because um, it all just kind of happened really quickly. Touring with the Flaming Lips was like probably one of my favorite experiences that I've had so far because I got to play to like big crowds all over the world, so that was really exciting and new for me. I was playing it cool and I totally felt fine until five minutes before and I burst out into tears and cried off all my makeup. <laughs> so it was definitely really nerve wracking. I'm working currently on my own album of original songs um, that I recorded in England. So I'm just like getting a band together and playing with them. Hey, we're Mount Rushka, downright rock from the heart of the Rockies.
Mount Rushka is currently Fernie's hottest rock band. While some of the members have known each other for a long time, the band officially formed in 2021. He gave me a guitar lesson, which I desperately needed, <laughs> and then we started playing music together. We just got together, we hung out, started, and I showed him a song that I wrote, and he really, really liked it, and wrote lyrics to it that afternoon. And that was the first song that we wrote. After we played a show at the Fernie one night, we're sitting around here, it's like 2 a.m., and we're talking about how the show went, and Aaron said, it's downright rock. And we're like, downright rock, man, I like that. And so that's what we call our, our sound, is downright rock. There, there is an album in the works. We, we definitely want to get back to focusing pretty heavily on, on recording and, and do what we do best, which is the music. For any bands that we like, new kids on the block uh, are Chungus. Uh, big shout out to Chungus, because they've, they've, they've been rocking some tunes for the last couple of years here, so we're really excited for them. Obviously, I'll say Shred Kelly, because they're, they're the iconic Absolutely. band of Fernie. Blue Steel is another up and coming band. The Runs, No Solid Hits. He's <laughs> number two. You can get more Mount Rushka on Spotify, Apple Music, YouTube, Facebook, MountRushka.band. Yeah, pretty much just Google Mount Rushka and we should come up. We're the only ones. We're the only ones. We're the only Mount Rushka. This is Fernie with Sadie. I hope you enjoyed our little tour of Fernie's incredible music scene. Obviously, this was just a small taste since Fernie has so many amazing artists and bands to discover, like The Runs, Chungus, Electric Blanket, Wild Honey, Lord Knows, The Heartbreaking Sirens, The Audiels, Blue Steel, Red Girl. Ha, 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 ha.